animal adaptations animal habitats the place which is an animal's natural home the environment which suits it well is called its habitat it provides the animal with food water and shelter everything it needs to survive for example a tiger's natural home or habitat is the forest a zoo or a circus is not the tiger's natural habitat where we normally see them different places have different kinds of plants and animals you will not see the same kinds of plants and animals all over the world forests grasslands mountains deserts along with the freezing lands around the poles and the different water bodies are all different habitats there are fresh water habitats like ponds rivers and lakes and salt water habitats like seas and oceans different animals live under different conditions a camel lives comfortably in the hot desert a polar bear is very happy living in the freezing cold climate of the north pole over millions of years animals have evolved to survive in their own habitats but if a habitat changes due to decreased or excess rainfall mostly decreased these days because of global warming the animal is unable to adapt quickly enough it finds it difficult to survive the ability of living things to adjust themselves to their environment is called adaptation it is because living things can adapt themselves to different environments we have such a wide variety of flora and fauna all over the earth types of animals according to their habitats animals can be classified into terrestrial animals aquatic animals amphibians aerial animals arboreal animals terrestrial animals animals that live on land are called terrestrial animals they generally have lungs to breathe and legs to walk a snake lives on land but it has no legs it crawls with the help of its scales a camel lives in the hot dry desert it has a thick skin its long legs keep the body away from the hot sand its thick leathery lips and tongue helps it to eat thorny bushes found in the desert its hump is like a backpack 
where it stores up food as fat. This fat is used by the camel when it does not get any food and water for days. The polar bear has very thick fur on its body. This protects it from the severe cold. It eats lots of fish and seals in the short summer season and stores fat in its body. This helps it to survive the long winter months when there is hardly any food available. Snakes, lizards and frogs are very active in summer. During winter they go to sleep. This period is called hibernation. Their bodies cannot adjust to the low temperature. Animal Adaptations Aquatic Animals Aquatic animals are the animals that live in water. Fish, ducks, whales, dolphins, swans, turtles are some aquatic animals. Some of them have distinct features. Fish have gills to breathe and fins to swim. Ducks have webbed feet and turtles have flippers to swim. Whales and dolphins are unique aquatic animals which swim with the help of flippers and breathe through lungs. Fish can live only in aquatic habitats. They feed on the aquatic plants and other water creatures. Mohens feed on water plants, insects and tadpoles. They build their nests in the shelter of the reeds that grow on the banks. Amphibians These animals spend part of their lives in water and part on land. Frogs, toads and salamanders are amphibians. They have lungs to breathe when they are on land. The young ones of these animals live in water and breathe through gills. Frogs have a moist skin which helps them to breathe when they are in water. Toads normally have dry skin. Frogs have long and strong hind legs to jump. Toads walk on land and have shorter hind legs. Both frogs and toads swim with their webbed feet when in water. Aerial animals Aerial animals are those animals that spend a lot of their time in the air. Birds, bats, insects like butterflies are aerial animals. They have wings to fly and light hollow bones which keep their body light. They do not spend their whole life in the air but as they are mostly airborne they can rightfully be called aerial animals. All aerial animals are 
not birds a bat is not a bird it is a mammal but it can fly all birds are not aerial animals ostrich penguin and emu cannot fly arboreal animals arboreal animals are animals that live on trees most of the time monkeys chameleons lizards squirrels are arboreal animals the tree is their habitat these animals have strong claws to cling to the branches monkeys have long strong tails with which they grasp the branches of trees and swing from them although the birds build their nests on trees they are not considered to be arboreal as they spend most of their time in the air